Okay, so I have to do this video quick because I have a test at 8.30 in the morning and it's like 10.55 and I'm just so not going to be into going. But this is my June favorites. So I'm going to start off with what I keep talking about. And no, just so you guys know, I don't even have a partnership. So nobody is paying me to say this. This is my honest opinion. This Urban Decay All Nighter is the shit. You guys need to go buy it because my lake up, I said my lake up, my makeup has been lasting all day. I'm sorry, you know how like when you talk too much and you get like that ring around your mouth, me and my sister call the kids like, like sperm, like the kids, whatever. But yeah, I love this. This has definitely been working for me. Keeping my makeup fresh all day. Um, my D squared tinted lip conditioner. Surprisingly, I do like this, even though I didn't think I was because of the smell. It still smells waxy and it doesn't taste like anything. I really think that Mac should like rethink some of their formulas because I think me personally, if their stuff had like a smell to it or like a little slight taste, I'd probably buy more lip stuff. But anyway, yeah, I like this because it definitely really does moisturize your lips. And I was scared that it was going to break out my lips because SPF stuff usually does. Um, what else is my favorite? Oh, my two blushes that I keep using in like all my videos. Bobby Brown Tawny and Max Copper Tone. I don't know if they, if Max still, Max even, excuse me, sells Copper Tone. But I really like this. I don't think that I'm going to wear these in the winter time because in the winter, I get lighter and more yellow so i don't think this is gonna look too flattering i mean i mean i think i get yellow or if that's a word more yellow but that's just my opinion maybe i will maybe i won't who knows but i definitely do really like these for the summer these are the two i've been reaching for a lot i kind of just put raisin in the back burner but who knows um yes so that's it for my blush um okay so the Too Faced Shadow Insurance, I used to use my concealer, the Studio Fix concealer, the real thick one that comes, look like comes in like the little eyeshadow thing. I used to use that as a base slash primer for my eyeshadow or the Urban Decay. And I definitely like this better than the Urban Decay. I don't know why people don't talk about this more because usually when I watch other gurus on YouTube, they're like, oh, to prime my lid, I'm using Paint Pot, or I'm using to what is, that, what is it? Urban Decay Primer Potion. I mean, if those work fine. But I don't use Painly personally because it's too light for me. I kind of use this all quite natural. Yeah, but like, yeah, this this is the shit. Go buy it. Test, just test it out. Like, I think that they could give you a sample of this. You could try it because it really does work like really well. Okay, so my Barbie Smudge Pot. I've only used the purple one quite a few times. And I don't think I'm going to use this as a base because it's supposed to be meant to be eyeliner. I don't think I'm going to use it as a base or anything because it dries really fast. But I really do like this. And the color is really good and it has a slight shimmer in it when you put it on. You can't really see it when you're looking at it. But yeah, it definitely has a slight shimmer when you put it on. And again, it's my favorite color. So, of course, it's going to be like in this June favorites. What else? Okay, so... My Urban Decay Lipstick and Gel Bait. As you can probably see, it looks fudged up because it melted and it got all crooked. And I still love it though. Because, ah, oh, look, see, it got crooked. See, oh, I need to order another one. But it broke because it was so hot. It's like, it's been like 100 degrees for like the past like couple of days. And like, it melted in my bag. I had to put it in the freezer. And I just took it out the freezer. And I didn't think it was going to open. Because it was like so much condensation on the inside. But yeah. It, they have like a little smell. Not a taste. But it has a smell. And I know nobody knows what I'm talking about. When I was younger. I had this vanity. And it was Tinkerbell. Not like Disney Tinkerbell. But like some other like Tinkerbell. And oh my gosh. Like they had like this little makeup. And it had that smell. And I just love it. because I guess just because it reminds me of my childhood. And it was or happy times for me but yeah so another one of my favorites is actually a hair product is Cantu's daily oil moisturizer and when you pour it in your hand it's really not an oil I'm gonna pour a little bit on it it's more like a cream see it's white it's more like a cream 
And every time I try to close, I get it everywhere, but it's a cream. And my hair is really thin, and usually it's longer than this, but I like to keep it this length because when it gets longer, it looks thinner, and I just don't like that. But this is not heavy on my hair, and a little bit goes a long way with this. Actually, I use a little bit more than this, but like, a little bit goes a long way with this. Um, and it's like one more thing I want to talk about. Yeah, so I'm definitely, I made the switch from that studio fix could finish whatever concealer because this is too heavy for me and this is much lighter and I use I feel like I use less product when I use this because I literally use like one or two dabs blend it in and I'm good good to go good to go I'm cool beans on that but this I just feel like it's so heavy oh it's so heavy like it's so freaking heavy like I don't have like a whole bunch of like black spots or craters in my face to like cover up Oh, and look, this is melting too. Like, you have like this oil or sweat on top. Oh, it's so shiny. It's not supposed to be this shiny. Oh, it's so hot. I can't wait for this heat wave to be over. I'm praying to God for some freaking 80 degree weather. Like, please answer my prayers. 80 degree weather. Because this 100 degrees is not working for me. And the air conditioner in my car is not working. Well, it hasn't been working since the summer, but it's never been so hot. I'm like, oh, I'm dying. The window being down is not enough. No, it's too damn hot. Too damn hot. Like, I don't even want my kids in the car because I'm like, they're going to pass out. We'll be so dehydrated with dry, crusty lips. And I hate seeing little kids with little dry, crusty lips. That's so not cool. Oh, wait. What's the last thing I want to talk about? Okay, yes. The last thing I want to talk about is my bag. I got this from Metro Park. Well, if you don't know what Metro Park is, it's, it's a store. They sell clothes and they're big on like clothes art and music and I don't know how many there are in New Jersey but I go to this one in Wayne and usually every time I go they like having a sale I have to put this in my hair because usually sitting on my hand doing nothing yeah but they're usually having a sale and this bag was on sale they got I got the little email on my Blackberry oh an extra 40% off of all stuff that's on sale so it was like $58 and I love it because it has these nice little pockets on the side and actually when I seen it on the website I thought it was gonna be bigger but I mean I guess it's a good size but like I've been using this bag every day and the actually the black bag that I was using before was actually smaller but it was like a satchel like kind of like the Louis Vuitton Speedy but it was small I got it from Aldo and it had these silver studs on it I thought it was cute but it still does hold all the stuff I've been using my glasses freaking my lint brush because when I go to work for some reason I always have lint on my pants and I have to wipe it off because then I won't be in dress code if I had lint on my pants. Hmm. My lotion. And I really like this lotion. I got it from the Victoria's Secret Outlet store. It's like $3. It smells really good and really nice for summer. I'm definitely not going to do it in winter because it has kind of a tropical smell. It's called, oh, duh. It's BG Coconut and Sugar Cane. So yeah, it, this smells really good. And actually light. Really light. Oh crap. I did forget to talk about one thing. Oh my god, where is it? Okay. Remember, okay, when I bought that Vaseline lotion? It has been replaced with this Nivea lotion. Nivea lotion is expensive to me for a drugstore lotion. Actually, it probably would have been cheaper at Walmart if I got at Walmart. But Rite Aid has this new thing where they have like a little Rite Aid card. You can accrue, 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 accrue points. And it was an extra 25% off if you had the card so I bought it and I love it and it has like a light smell like it, it goes well with any perfume because the smell is so light and fresh smell it smells really fresh like I really love putting it on after I get out the shower I'm like oh I'm gonna smell so good once I put on my Nivea yeah I love it so I guess that's it I'm gonna go to bed I'm probably gonna film a video Maybe tomorrow because I have an interview for a place that I can't tell you guys because I don't get too excited just because I don't get it because I want to go, I want to have a job that's more into the field that I want to go in, which is fashion. But I'm about to go to bed. You guys keep subscribing, keep watching, rate, comment, let me know what I can do to improve. And I guess I'll see you guys later. So, bye. Wait, it's still going. <laughs>